Now at 6, a Victorian man who commutes to Midland recently had his truck broken into at a Midland RV park. And this has him speaking out tonight about his stolen property. Good evening. Thank you for joining us tonight. Madeline is off. ABC Big 2's Mike Mone is at that RV park and brings us the latest. Justin Morgan says he's concerned after somebody broke into his truck and stole Christmas shopping money as well as a firearm. But it's that stolen gun that has him speaking out. The cash, you know, it is what it is. They're not going to be able to do anything with that. But I just wanted to make sure there was no crimes committed with my firearm, so that's why I reported it stolen right away. Morgan says he won't let that stolen Christmas money ruin his holiday, but that he does have safety concerns with the Midland RV park following the theft of his pistol, especially since his employees also stay there. I'll be back out in West Texas next week, and I plan on visiting our management there because I have uh, several campers there that my employees stay at as well. So I'm going to see what their idea is or what they can do to avoid this from happening again, or we're going to have to find another park. And while Morgan says he'd like to see an increase in security at the Midland RV Park, he wants to make it clear he is not bad-mouthing a business he's been staying at for almost a year. It's not the it's not the RV Park's fault. I mean, if somebody wants to break in something, they're going to do it regardless of where it's at, you know. But uh, I feel like there could be different measures they can do to keep this from happening again, for sure. I reached out to the Midland Sheriff's Office to see if they could provide any additional details, but they could only confirm that they are investigating a break-in at the Midland RV Park. In Midland, Mike Mahoney, ABC Big 2 News.